Hi, I'm Tom Fallbush, General Manager of WBNA Television and the producer of Dream Funders. And we want to congratulate you for getting to this point. Uh, you have made, made it through the vetting process and you are now going to be on the show. And so, which is wonderful, it's very exciting. And, 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 uh, and so, but there is a uh, one step here we have to get through and I want to create this video to help, uh, help you step through this document called the Participation Agreement, which is a, just a long, it's long, I admit it's, it's long, it's, it's, uh, but it's a, basically a, a document that, that kind of spells out um, your, your participation in the program legally uh, and how all the rules are set up and, and, and just for, uh, to frame things in a way so that you can think about uh, how to approach this from a, from a business and a legal standpoint. And so, um, so I'm just going to step through section by section and try to give a quick layman's uh, terms approach to what this language is saying. Uh, don't use this as the legal, you know, version of, of this. So you still need to read this yourself and go through it. But I want to kind of give you a quick snapshot of what these sections are saying so that um, so it doesn't seem as intimidating to you if you just are reading this by yourself. Um, so, okay, so here we go. I'm going to just go through it. And here we go. Participation agreement and release. Um, let's see, I'm going to, on this first page, I think the key thing is um, I acknowledge that I am our team member thereof, as it must be complete. Okay, basically saying it's you're going to fill this out. So, so there we go. Let me just skip on. I'm going to skip down to represent, representations and warranties, uh, part five here. Uh, the, First part, uh, this basically says you're free and clear to appear legally. There's no issues that you, know, you can legally appear on this show. And, um, and also, the, the part B says this is your idea, no one else's idea that you're representing. This is your idea. And so that's important. We don't want to misrepresent. Okay, I'm going to skip down to G. Uh, it, it asks if you've appeared anywhere else uh, on another show like this. It's not, not that it's a big deal for us, but uh, just good to know. Uh, so if you have, just let us know that. Um, make sure part H. Make sure you're not involved in any lawsuits uh, that we're aware of, and, and uh, that could be controversial. And so we want to stay away from that. So, um, part six here under the application selection participation in the series. Uh, realize you're not getting paid. Part six, you're not getting paid to do this. This is a voluntary thing. Part seven, uh, it's up to us who we who we pick to appear on the show, and that's that's spelled out clearly. Uh, go down to part nine. Uh, don't misrepresent yourself. I mean, if you are so and so business and you're, you, uh, uh, you know, you are saying you do this, make sure you are going to do that. And it's just, you know, just you know, be be honest about who you're representing. Um, let's see. Part ten. Uh, we are not part of the investment group. You know, so you don't want to be. Uh, we're not going to be part of party to anything you're doing with the show from an investment standpoint. Um, so our, for example, a WBNA will not be a partner within your business to, to, um, you know, to do anything. All, all we're here to do is just do, do a television show to help you find funding with our panelists. So, um, part 7, uh, or part 11, um, you know, we it's, it's a federal offense to do anything to rig or any way influence the outcome of the series, so that's pretty clear. You don't want to don't want to cheat. Um, part twelve, you sh shall appear as yourself, um, and you're not being employed by us. Part thirteen, um, you're responsible for maintaining any insurance to that's involved in the show, or just insurance policies to cover any harm you may suffer in the connection of the series. Um, part fourteen, I understand that I may be chosen as an alternate. Uh, if chosen as an alternate, and I'm selected to be an alternate, and do not eventually join the series as a participant, I should not have any chance to make any presentation on, on DreamFunders. So we probably will have a few extra people that we've picked uh, that may not end up getting on the program because of uh, just whatever, uh, you know, for example, um, say someone is sick the night of a shoot, we, we're going to have an alternate there so that uh, we can have, um, we can go on with the show. and so. But if, but if that alternate shows up and everybody else shows up, then they won't, be, won't, won't appear that night. So just be aware of that. Um, and we're going to try to work the alternates in for the first season into the second season. So don't, don't fret that you're, 
uh, time is wasted. So um, we, w we do want to encourage everybody that makes it through the vetting process to be on the show. It's just uh, there's only so many slots for this first season. So um, let's see, you promised to obey all the rules, part, part 15. So obey the rules, and the rules are in here. Um, Let's see, you, you just under, part 16, we'll, you'll probably be at the shoot for a while. It's a, probably a two to three hour shoot. Um, and so you get there, you'll wait for a bit, you're, you, know, you prepare for your presentation, you'll, you'll go on. It'll probably be about, probably be, be about a 10 or 15 minute presentation. And, uh, but we would like for you to stay through the entire uh, shoot if possible. So, um, all right, and you also, part 17, you agree to participate in any all activities required by uh, in connection with the series and so that's basically just show up and you know and and get some money so, <laughs> so that's 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 all we want you to do is walk away with a check but uh no well not literally it's just anyway. okay participate in, you, you, you agree to participate in any screen tests you you agree to obtain releases from your um, from from you and maybe your media family or whoever is related to this that might be um, involved in the show um, you agree to participate in any activities outside of the show if we had any for example if we wanted to shoot a promo to promote the show we might have you show up and you know at a location and, and, uh, and just you know say hi I'm, I'm going to be on dream funders watch me you know that you know that's what we're not going to do anything beyond that though um, okay and understand there are rules to this and we are going to um, uh, lay those out, but we have the right to change the rules uh, at any time we need to, just for whatever reason. So, uh, so part 18 is, is discusses that. Part 19, um, it's up to you to do your due diligence. I'm sorry, let me back up and say this. Um, this is a very important part, so I want to read this out. I understand and agree that any on-camera commitment by one or more dream funders to make an investment in connection with the business that I present shall be contingent upon my and the applicable, applicable dream funders, or that's the funder, member of the panel, reaching a binding written uh, uh, agreement satisfactory to both dream funders and me following the completion of the production. I agree to, to negotiate in good faith exclusively with the dream funder or his or her or their designees to come to a binding written agreement and acknowledge that that I may be requested by the dream funders to enter into additional agreements to such effect. I understand the, and agree that the, it's customary for parties to conduct due diligence as to the suitability of the viability and suitability and viability of the transaction. And uh, so, basically, you know, this if 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 you go on the program and one of the dream funders say, "I love your idea," I'm going to get behind you and fund that because that's a I'm I'm excited about your idea. What that does is that basically uh, sets up a meeting post-production where you and him, uh, you and him or her, uh, or that group of people he represents, works out that, w what that looks like. And um, he may say on the show, I wanna, I'm gonna give you $50,000. I just think I've got it, you know, I've got it right now, I'm gonna write a check, and I think this is tremendous. You know, after, when you have that meeting afterwards, $50,000 may be on the table there, but it's not guaranteed just because he says it on the air. He still has to do some due diligence. He or she has to do some due diligence about your concept, about your business, but, but um, let me say this, if they do make an on-air commitment to want to, want to fund your business, uh, that, that's a pretty important statement in, in, in the process. And so, so, so take heart there that, that they're not just saying that to, uh, for, for good television purposes. They're here to actually fund some businesses and make some money. So and help people and help you. So um, anyway, all right. Um, so make sure you understand that part. And then let's see, uh, part 20, if there's a malfunction with the cameras or audio, uh, it's, it's um, you know, that's, that's our problem. And, but it's, you know, we, it's still, there's no issue. You know, if, if it happens, it happens. And there's no recourse on your part if things mess up because things just do sometimes. And, and, uh, and we're, we're going to have to, we'll, we'll, we'll avoid that, of, of course, but, but, um, but anyway, things, things do mess up. So read that part about section 20. 21, um, uh, just you promise not to steal other people's ideas. 
basically, okay? Uh, 22, you won't break things. Just don't break stuff while you're there. <laughs> so we just want you to be well behaved. All right, 23, um, you don't know us. You're, you're not uh, friends or acquaintances or, or, um, or uh, work for us or anything like that. You're, you're not connected to the producers of the program in any way uh, other than just you've reached out to us to be on the show. That's it. So just want to make sure there's no favoritism going on there. Um, you also, 24, you agree to not mention or plug any product or device um, except as directed by the producer. Um, and so, so you don't want to get on there and say, hi, I'm so-and-so business, but, but hey, we also do this and it's a great idea and you should buy it. You know, well, that's, that's kind of a free advertising for that business and we're not going to allow that. Um, okay. You're also uh, prohibited to wear any uh, t-shirts that promote the business or promote your ideas. Um, unless it's been approved by us. So if you have a t-shirt for your business, then you wear it, great, okay. But you know, just we don't want to have any sort of trademarks or logos for businesses that are um, not, um, not approved by us. So um, understand that neither, um, let's see, 26. Okay, and we want to make sure you don't use any of our you know, logos unless you're uh, given permission. For example, if you go out and promote, hey, I'm going to be on Dream Funders on your website or on our email blast, that probably is a good thing for the show and for us, but we want to know if you're doing that and so we can give you permission to do that because that is our trademark. Um, okay. Okay, taxes. 27, you understand there's taxes uh, if you do get um, an investment and there's tax laws related to that so you understand that they're, you got to pay your taxes if there's some some income there. Uh, 28, uh, if you quit the program, the rules that you agree to still apply. And so that doesn't get you out of the agreement uh, related to things that are tied in with the show. So make sure if you sign this, you understand that if I do walk away, I'm still obligated to a lot of these provisions here. So, um, but, uh, but anyway, that, but that's probably goes without saying. Okay, investment representations and warranties. Uh, let's see, I'm going to take a pause here and then we're going to come right back. Okay, now we're back. Part 29, um, there are laws governing securities and investments and 29 basically says that you understand those laws. And so, um, so you probably want to get, um, get with somebody to understand some of these laws to make sure that you're doing everything right. And, and the investors themselves, they're certified investors, they understand these laws as well. So, um, so they're just, we just want to make sure you understand that there are laws about investing that are governed by the Security Exchange Commission and, and different things. So, so those are issues that you just need to be aware of and make sure you understand that. Uh, part 30, um, we're not going to give you advice about those laws. We're not a we're not a law firm. We're not your attorney. So I just want to let you know that you need to make sure you have your own counsel about those issues. But but you understand that we're not not giving you advice on this. Uh, Thirty one, uh, just don't lie to the investors. Don't lie to them. If you say you've got a business plan that's done this, that, and the other, don't misrepresent. Say that you know, tell the truth. You know. Is they they want to invest in good ideas and, and even if it's just an idea at phase they want to invest it but just you, there's no reason to embellish just be truthful and and, um, and and let the idea stand on its own merit. Um, okay, th I'm gonna skip on down to 33. 33 is basically a, just a personal release. That that whole section is just a, another release form. You've, you've already signed a release for the audition release and the first initial, initial application packet, but but this is sort of an extended version of that. And so it's just saying that you're allowed, uh, you, you give us permission to have your image on, on television. So, so it's just a big, long, multi-page version of that. So I'm just going to skip through all that because it's all pretty straightforward. Okay. And then 35, um, consents and authorizations. Basically says you're in good condition to do this physically, mentally, uh, emotionally. And, uh, and, and it's also, uh, 36, we want to uh, stress that we're going to, we're going to do some sort of background check on everybody that's involved in the show just to protect ourselves and, and you understand that we're going to do that. Um, pretty standard, straightforward thing. It's not a, not a big deal. Um, let's see, 37, 
uh, you understand that this might be a stressful, you know, uh, stressful uh, sort of experience, but we're not, our, our intention is not to make this super stressful for you. We, we want to help you. We, we're here to help, help develop your business, but, but uh, you know, just being on camera is stressful. So yeah, we just want to make sure you understand that and that you're clear about, um, you know, some of, those, some of those stresses involved in that. Uh, 38, uh, I will not bring with me any illegal dangerous items. So don't come packing. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's, but, you know, just, just whatever. It's a little something you have to put in there. Um, okay, assumption of risk. These are all pretty standard uh, injuries and risk. You're assuming your own risk to show up. You know, in case a, a light falls from the ceiling and bumps you in the foot, you know, you're, that, there's a risk there. Um, okay, 45 is just you're releasing uh, either party from suing each other just in case there's any sort of, any sort of up, if you're upset about something or another, you, you've released uh, yourself and us to, from suing one another. So. Pretty, pretty involved little section there. You gotta just read through it, make sure you understand what you're, what you're signing. Um, but it's pretty clear, you just promise you won't sue us if there's something that goes wrong. Um, okay, yeah, I think the rest of this is pretty, pretty standard stuff. Uh, more releases, um, confidentiality. Uh, this is important, section 50, you promise to keep everything secret. You won't say bad things about the show. You won't, uh, for example, say you get on the program and, and you, you may not get any funding. Uh, we, we would prefer that you, we ask you not to go out and say anything negative about the program. And so um, we're gonna give you a fair shot and we're gonna, you know, it's gonna be, a, I think, a good experience for you. So, but in case there's any sort of hard feelings, we ask that you uh, keep things to yourself uh, if you can, and, and we'll do the same. You know, we're not here to embarrass people. We're we're, uh, we're here to do uh, do some good work. So, um, all right. Let's see. Okay, miscellaneous provisions. Um, yeah, I think the rest of this is pretty pretty standard stuff. I'm, I might be skipping over something that might be important. If so, just feel free to contact us. Um, Fifty six. You've been. Uh, afforded the opportunity to review this document with your own legal counsel prior to signing. This agreement should not be construed in favor or against any party by reason of the drafting of all or any of the parts of this. It basically says you've been given a chance to read this, and so, yeah, so you'll, you, you do have this in front of you, I hope. Um, okay, 70, uh, oh, never mind, that's it's all good. Okay, 71, mediation, you agree to mediation if there's any sort of issues. Um, and then uh, I guess the last thing, just be quiet, uh, be quiet about all this until it airs. In other words, I just, those are my own notes. Basically, if, if you do win, if, or you say you do get an, uh, some funding, we prefer that you keep that under, under your hat until the show airs, because we, we, we don't want to take away from the impact of the, of the moment, you know, when the show airs. So, so keep all that private if you can. And uh, okay, the last, let's see, Exhibit A is uh, just the rules. You can read through that. It basically just tells you the, the process and the, and the rules. And I may do another video explaining that further, but I'm just gonna let the rules stand as they are. They're pretty straightforward um, and easy, easy to read. Uh, let's see, you can be disqualified. There's, there's different ways to, to, to look at the rules. Okay, um, Exhibit B basically says you're an entity that could accept investments, basically what that means. And, I, and so, um, and it kind of spells out, we want you to spell out who your, uh, what the holding entity is. Is it an LLC? Is it a sole proprietorship? Who's involved in, in that? Uh, if it's a board of directors, just we just want to know those issues so that we can, we can vet that process. Um, emergency medical release, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, business information form, that's pretty straightforward as well. A couple more items, uh, there's an intellectual property questionnaire that's just a questionnaire about uh, do you own the property, do you, do you own the, the idea, and, uh, and so we just want, to, want you to fill that out to kind of explore those questions in more depth. And uh, there's also one more small document about a background check that you basically release us to do a background check on, on you. Okay. Our contract's fun, so, <laughs> so that, that's a lot to go through, and uh, that's why I wanted to do this video, just to kind of give you a sense of 
what some of this is about. Um, you, you do want to have somebody look at this with you and understand it with you. And uh, but it's like I said, our our goal here is to not um, not to do uh, any, anything that would uh, take advantage of anybody. Uh, and so, but we just have to protect ourselves as well. And uh, and and our goal is really just to help you develop a business and and, and have some fun doing it and and, uh, and help help uh, bless the city on on a, on a level that's uh, that uh, maybe that we could help help do. So anyway. Um, Thank you for your time, and I'll, I'll wrap this video up. And congratulations for being on the show. We're very excited about your participation, and, um, and let's make some great television together. Thank you. Bye-bye.